brand new day and we have just picked up an order. In today's episode, we're gonna be running DoorDash and Uber Eats. If you remember in the previous episode, we put in our application to get accepted on DoorDash and Uber Eats and today we've just been accepted. Just picked up our first order for $8.67. You're stuck with me today. Yeah, be useful. Thanks. <laughs> Hi, good morning, it is me. At the end of the video, I'm gonna give you a little, little hint on today's video. It was awesome. You need to watch to the end of this video because there are so many twists, so many unexpected moments. The amount that we earned, you'll be very, very shocked to learn how much we made all day running Uber. So last night, we spent our night in the sleeping bag in the back seat of the car. And now, let's just say we're gonna be in here for a lot longer, because we gotta drop off Duncan. In today's episode, we're gonna be figuring out exactly how much money you can make. Right on West Grand Parkway North, then turn right. In today's episode, we're gonna figure out exactly how much you can make off DoorDash and Uber Eats in just a single day. And there we are. Second order being done right now. And that second order got us six dollars and something cents. So eight plus six plus a few cents. Should say seven plus eight, 15 bucks in like 30 minutes. I hope no one sees this and then realize I'm recording their food. Major problem with DoorDash and Uber is when you're delivering to apartments, you can't get inside. All of them have codes and gates and numbers. I don't know where to get. I get that car charger right there. Just unplug it. <laughs> we just bought a plug-in for the car and we just got gas. Red light. I saved you. <laughs> We're already stopped. Yeah, but the camera didn't get it, so. <laughs> okay. Ah! Stay in your seat. Don't mess with the driver. Don't mess with the passenger. No, you're at my disposal. Disposal? <laughs> so we just got confirmation on Facebook Marketplace. We have someone meeting us over at the storage unit later today. We have that brown couch finally sold. So at the moment, Uber is not performing very well. We're averaging less than $10 an hour right now, and we've gotten order after order after order that is saying $3.20 for this order, $3.19, $3 and something. We've done DoorDash in the past, but the only problem is we're not on DoorDash at the moment. You have to have a scheduled time for DoorDash unless you reach X amount of deliveries in a month. So right now we can't get on DoorDash and Uber is not paying very well. And for $3.78, we got a chicken sandwich, a 10 piece nugget, and a single burger, plus two water cups, water cups, that got us tea and Dr. Pepper. A few inches later. My belly hurts.
just drove to pick up a $20 order at Sonic and they just canceled it as we got to the door. Fire truck. Gotta put a little pause in our DoorDash right now because actually we're not even doing DoorDash. You gotta deliver that first. Yeah, we gotta deliver that first. And then we gotta go over to the storage unit because this guy is like 35 minutes away from the storage unit and we are 25 minutes away, but we still have to drop this off and he's gonna be buying that brown couch. So, drive faster. No, I don't wanna take it. Then outrun the cops. <laughs> Not in this car. <laughs> Not in this car. All right, we're here, but he beat us. So I don't really know where I'm setting the camera up. I never, oh my God, never want to move a couch again. Good luck. Good luck. <laughs> we cleared out all of that so fast and moved that couch into that guy's truck. It's all worth it because, do you have the money? Oh, I have the money. We got, oh. $100 in cash and $35 online through Zelle. So that's $135 profit right there. All right, so you start moving all that stuff back in there and I'm gonna watch. Do you want a ride? Damn. <laughs> Okay, first off, my head really hurts. Second off, we're back to door dashing. So the guy we just sold that couch to, we're asking, hey, how are you? Just small talk. I'm just going through a divorce right now. My sixth one. Sixth divorce? I just don't understand. You- He was happy and cheerful. He was very happy and cheerful. For a guy that's been through six divorces, he was very happy and cheerful. Yes! Oh my God, I did it! What? I got the rim. Oh, <laughs> I know I was there. $25, we got a rim. They were listed on Facebook for like 125, 130. Yeah, we got it for 25. Yes, sir. How's it going? I'm good, how are you? Miguel. Sir. Thank you. This has been hard to come by. I have four, I was selling them. This guy came by, he was like, hey, how much for this? Oh, I just wanted one. Wow. I'm like, ooh, <laughs> you, man. I'm a... And then he was like, nah, I just want one. Yeah, when you said you only had three, I was gonna buy all four just so I could get one. That <laughs> car got hit on the other side. I was gonna say, if one of y'all's uh, light is going, is going out, but it looks different from mine. Mine, mine goes, went out. Yeah. It's going out. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, so you got the LED on there. Yeah, so yeah that one's harder. All right, man. All right, thank you. Y'all doing it on YouTube series or what? Yes, sir. Yes. Cameras right there. Our whole life's on, on camera. You check out Life's Adventures on YouTube? I'll check y'all out. Right. I'll be looking at some random stuff. <laughs> right. Okay. We have just picked up the rim, $25, and in tomorrow's episode, we're gonna put it on the car. But as of right now, we need to get back to DoorDash because we have not met our goal of the day of how much. Uber. Uber, my bad. DoorDash is not letting us on. So we're still doing Uber. Happy? <laughs> yes. All right, so to pick up the rim, we might've had to drive all the way out to Houston, but we are on our way back to the Katy area and we're gonna continue doing Uber Eats on the way, and we have just gotten a $15 order. So, on our way we go. All right, we are just finished up door dashing, not door dashing, doing Uber. So, we're gonna go to the one place that is still open, in and out and we will share our profits with you in just one moment. Uber Eats, all 
day we pretty much did it obviously we had a few extra things we sold the couch we bought the rim but for the most part we went for about 11 hours doing this so we had a bunch of things we even had walgreens like medicaid medication pickups it was a ton of stuff but what did we profit at the end of the day we made 108 dollars and 32 cents among the both of us. And the reason we do both of us is because he can drive and then I can hurry and run in there. That way he doesn't have to park and it's faster. But our phone was dying. And well, that's kind of a necessity when you're running Uber. So we had to run in there and get a cord, which cost us $8.41, bringing us down to $99.91. <laughs> doesn't stop there. We then went to Wendy's and we ate for $3.78. We then <laughs> had to pay for gas, which cost $25. And that is when we had the opportunity to meet up with someone that I messaged on Facebook to buy the rim for the car. He said today is the only day he could, the rest of the week he would be busy at work. Bought the rim for $25, which we will put on the car hopefully tomorrow. Now you're thinking, okay, $46 all day, whatever. No. Remember our deal we have with the car. $40 a day we have to pay. Every day that we do DoorDash, we have to spend $40. Yeah, because if you rent a car, it's gonna be $65, $75. So we pay $40, that leaves us with $6.13. <laughs> $6.13. We divide that amongst the two of us, we both earn $3.06. <laughs> I earn $3.06 and he earned $3.06. That was what we have to show for our day. But I sold my couch. That's an extra $135 on my end. Was it all worth it? You tell me. I was gonna ask, are you ready to go to bed? I'm tired. You're tired? Okay. I'm tired. Go to bed. Good night guys. I'll see you tomorrow.